name is Major Onaban, a graduate of the Federal Polytechnic Nevada, Kogi State. I studied science laboratory technology and I specialize in chemistry. I'm here to teach you and show you how to produce ISA. Now, before we start, I will want to introduce the materials to you. First, this is fine oil and this is um, dissolved texapon and this is phenol this is phenol and here is lyso here is booster there's isal booster and here we have the isal concentrates and here we have the carbolic acid and lastly we have the whitener that is what gives Isal the white color. Then we look at the equipment. This is our production tank. This is a measuring cylinder and a funnel. And we have beakers. This is a 1,000 cm cube beaker. And this is 500 cm cube beaker. We have a cup. And then a small bucket. Then this is our container to fill the the product and this is our sterile. Now, very importantly, you must have your nose mask for your nose and then your hand gloves and then your apron as I'm putting on to cover my body because you are going to work with chemicals. Now, we start the production. Now, we start. The first thing is to protect yourself, cover your hands. Now, I will have covered my nose from the beginning to the end, but uh, I will, you will not really hear me, so I have to reserve myself. So when I speak, you can hear me, so I can learn a lot. Now, the first thing is, we will take, measure our pine oil. One cup of pine oil. Now the next thing is phenol. And before we measure the phenol, before we even open it, I have to cover my nose because it's a very toxic chemical. So I'll measure phenol, two cups of phenol. That is two cups of phenol and one cup of pine oil. Then you stay. Make sure you don't put your nose. Now, the next thing is your texapon. Most times you might not dissolve it. With the phenol and the pine oil, you can easily dissolve your uh, texapon. But this one I have already dissolved it. So you measure. You take a little sample of it.
if it were to be undissolved texapon, we would take a cup of this. But since we have dissolved it, we will take two or three cups. That will give us three cups or three and about or two and about uh, three cups of the texapon and then you stir. Okay, the next thing is for you to prepare, that is, you are finished with that, you keep it aside, and you prepare your carbolic acid and your thickener. You dissolve them in water. So we will get water and then dissolve it. Now you get water, at least, um, say, a liter of water. That's one liter of water. You can turn it into the, the bucket. You get your carbolic acid. And you measure two cups of it into the water. and stir. Mix with the water. Okay. You now measure the white thickener. One cup of the white thickener. water and rinse it. And then you stay. And you keep it. You now bring back your phenol texapon, uh, sorry, yes, into phenol texapon and a uh, fine oil mixture. And you get your lysol. Don't mind this label here, it's just a container. You can use any container to buy this, okay? When you go to buy it, to buy it in any container you want to buy. So, we measure, there are two cups of Lyso. This is Lyso. You measure your two cups into the mixture of fine oil, phenol, and texapon. Thank you. 
The next one is the booster. The major booster, two cups. And you stir it, continue to stir it. See how mix it is. Now at this point, you now turn the solution of the carbolic acid and the white uh, whitener into it. Now lastly, you now add your Isal concentrates into the mixture. You're going to add two cups of that. Get leave water. Get at least a five hundred ml of water. Turn it into this so that you can release it and turn it inside with the container with your cup. Release your cup in. Then turn it into this mixture. Your eyes are. At that point, you have produced a very powerful eyes. Are. Now, the next thing you do is to package your products, and here is the container for eyes. You get your funnel and then your cup, whatever thing you want to use, and scooping it.
and then you cook it. This is your eyes are. What is left now for you to do is to get your label, label it, and make sure you have to register your name, your product. Very important. You label it. The next thing you start making your money. So why sitting down and then going to the street is in search of an uh, existing job? You want a white collar job? No, they are not existing anymore. With this, you can be a boss of your own. You can make money of your own. You wake up anytime you want. You sleep anytime you want. You do anything you want because you are the boss of your own. Why not stand up, pick up something, get your hand to do something? That rather than sitting down or going the streets looking for a job. Now with this, you can make so much money. For you to learn this and many more, log on to the address you see on your screen, call on the number, send us an email. We will guide you step by step on how you can be a boss of your own. Thank you.